I'd like to make before we move off that is if you look at the line right about employee separation cost, mm -hmm. right now it's running low, okay, low. So one could argue, okay, that there's sort of a wash between the two, sort of. Not exactly, but one sort of offsets right. the other. If the separation costs continue the same, and if we don't keep blowing this line we're talking about up anymore. So, I mean, when you're looking at the budget, you have to keep in mind sometimes one account will work against another one to some degree or offset it. You see what I'm saying? Absolutely. You have to sort of play a balancing act there a little bit. And the selectmen, I'm sure, and the financial people will watch that for us. But anyway, when you're looking at this, you, if you look at the remarks, usually those things like that are covered by Mike, uh, well, Mal Christie's remarks, which is really handy. If you're trying to get familiar with this document, read the first two or three pages. You're doing yourself a big okay. favor. Thank you. I'm awesome. Thank you.